Juliana Coles. Welcome back to my Pirate Queen's Artist Residency YouTube channel. I'm getting back to work on my pirate postcards. And if you'd like to learn more about my Pirate Queen's Artist Residency and mail art, please subscribe to my Pirate Queen's Residency YouTube channel. And now it's time to get back to work. Going postal in a pirate. Pirate kind of way.
I'm painting on this um, collage item, and this is actually um, something I cut out. So it's an original. This is not um, a copy. And that's where you get into trouble. When you're taking someone else's artwork, and this is something vintage. I don't even know if this still has a copyright on it. But um, you're not allowed to print someone else's artwork. And... Um, You know, that's copyright infringement. So here, this is the original. I cut it out from an old uh, magazine. Uh, but when I'm putting it on a piece, I'm painting it in partly because this was torn over here. But now that I've painted this in, I want to integrate this over here with this paint. So I'm also using the paint to integrate more fully this, but to also work back into this. You know, not to just leave it completely as the other person's artwork, but you know, having some of my hand in that too. So if you're using someone else's stuff, which you shouldn't, um, but I guess it seems like in this day and age, everybody is, um, you know, at least try to put in a little of your hand back into it so it's, you're not completely stealing. And usually something like this, um, this seems obvious that I didn't make it, that I stole it. Like, that's not my style. It's not the look of my work. So I don't think there's any um, issue about, you know, oh, I, I'm pretending I did that. That's clearly a collage. So that's something collaged on. And then over here with the tape, um, when you do something like this that's very high contrast with the black. Um, if I put white paint over that, even sometimes just so, it's not going to hide it. So what I like to do sometimes, and it gives it a little bit more texture, is I put this masking tape over it and then I like to wrap it to the other side. That also gives a little bit more texture over here so that's something I can deal with. So underneath this is actually a kind of a torn piece from um, an original drawing of mine. I don't know what that red ink is going to do. Okay, good. That's stable. That's great. Um, this is actually a print um, of mine. So this is all mine, my writing, my drawing here. So I'm not, I'm not worried about that. And I usually like to look at the corners here and see if they're bent up. Let me see if I have one here. Um, but a lot of times if it's bent up, then I'll take tape and wrap that around too if it's getting damaged. Um, it might get damaged in the mail and that's sometimes why I like to just stiffy up the corners because that's the part that's going to get the most dink, dink, um, possibly bent. So I like to give it a little bit more structure, sometimes uh, even with just some clear tape. Yeah, I know. Not archival. Okay. Back to work.
things about um, repairing things. And where did I just see that? It, it's splitting. I can see my cart, my map board is splitting. Um, one of the things about making repairs is that it, um, you know, when I have to go back in and redo all of this stuff, it gives it, you know, more life, actually. You know, I always say the life is in the layers. And hopefully this, get this guy. Yeah, you're splitting. Okay, so I'll have to redraw all of this on this side and recolor that, but that's okay. I like to do that. This guy, what is going on here? Okay. Yeah, so I like, you know, with the postcards, you know, it's like working in a book. You're working on both sides. You're always, you know, tending to things. And that tending to things can uh, often just, you know, decide what's next. Okay. Like what needs to happen next. Okay, she's getting spooky as she needs to be. Okay, I think that's coming along. Let that stick down a little, figure out what I'm gonna do here. If I'm gonna finish this or just take all of this out, which uh, I don't know yet. I'll have to fix that and maybe I don't know if that's coming up or... Yeah. Okay. Boy, this guy's a mess. So it looks like this, whatever is under here, and it's quite a few layers at this point, um, is coming up. So we're just going to get some tape in there, get some tape down here. Boy, this guy's going to get really... So maybe I'll do one more thing here. So this is also why these take so long, is because all of this back and forth, all this layering that I'm doing, it just really, really is time consuming, part of my insanity, and yeah, it just takes a really, really long time. Okay, but I think this guy's getting closer to something a little bit more interesting.
Pozdol. If you'd like to learn more of my art tips and tricks, I hope you'll subscribe to my Pirate Queen's YouTube channel. Thanks for your support, Juliana Coles.